Hey guys, Beast from Beast Toys here coming at you. Happy New Year. First time I've done a video this uh, since uh, the New Year started. It is only the third, by the way. Just a couple of days. So we're going to do a Scarlet Snake Eyes version. This is number 20 in the classified line. I do have all of these. I did not double up um, on any of them but Scarlet. And the only reason I doubled up on Scarlet is because uh, I found her on Amazon relatively cheap. $10.99. Um, actually, I got one at $14 or $15.99 and decided that uh, when I saw these, I was like, yeah, I'll go ahead and get them. But, uh, of course, the artwork's a little different. You got the Snake Eyes package, and I think that's a bad idea. I'm um, going to tell you that I think that putting this in the classified line in the numbered in the series, um, bad idea. Um, I don't think that many people are really down with uh, these classified figures. I think this is probably one of the only ones people may have cared about, maybe. I don't know. I could be wrong. Um, could be way off. So, um, I mean, again, artwork's kind of cool. Um, you get a Scarlet who's, in all reality, relatively close. Um, I have noticed to the somewhat close to the original sorry um i'm wiggling so her waist seems loose or her legs um, that left one very loose bends fairly easily so i don't know that she'll stand up very well she's really loose this is really loose this one's not very good um yeah i guess that's why it's an opener so I mean, otherwise, she looks decent. Um, you know, if this was the more of the tan across the chest instead of on the arm pieces, um, you would pretty much have close to the classic look. She comes with a classic type crossbow, and that is it. So, not much to her figure itself. Um, you got the crossbow, no other weapons, and the figure. So. Um, you don't, like I said, you don't really get a lot with this one, so, uh, the 1099 price tag to me was perfectly fine. Now, there are people out there I know a while back that did get her at 499 on Amazon. Um, not sure how that worked out. I did not get in on that. Every time I saw that post somewhere and tried to cut two or three times it came out, I never got to it, so... But I did catch it at ten ninety. Like I said, ten ninety nine, fifteen ninety nine first, or fourteen ninety nine, then ten ninety nine. Hit it at the ten ninety nine. So I now actually have an extra one. Um, was going to send it back, but it wasn't an Amazon Prime seller, or it wasn't Prime uh, Amazon. So um, I would have had to pay to ship it. And I'm like, you know, I just got an extra one. So I'll just maybe get rid of it somewhere down the line or trade it. So anyway, yeah. So this part concerns me a little bit, you know, looking at her figure. Everything else seems pretty okay. Um, just this one left leg, really, really loose. Just feel like, like it bends forward even a little bit. This one does not, so I'm not sure what is causing that. Must be, it's a piece down here. Because when you look at it, her leg from the back, it almost looks like it's bowed pushed back a little bit the knee so um i don't know that she'll stand very well she's not trying to stand very well on her own so yeah i, I mean it's just a bad piece here so otherwise otherwise i mean it's fine um so See if you can get a close-up view. So, not everybody uh, gets gets them like this. I'll be honest, though, the downside, the Joe team for Hasbro is much, much better than the uh, Star Wars team. The Star Wars team is probably the worst team in Hasbro, if you ask me when I look at it. Um, you know, those dudes, that Patrick guy, and, you know, the girl. I, I just don't think they know Star Wars. I think they're just there because it's a job and it's they probably make good money and they get to play mess with toys a little bit Honestly, they probably would rather be doing something else. I get the feeling sometimes the designer guy 
He seems to be in it, but he just has no energy. Um, and I'm not saying I do. Believe me, if you watch me, <laughs> you're like, what are you talking about, B? Um, but anyway, so, yeah, see, there is this piece. When I stand it still, and I can push it forward. This one does not come forward. So, yeah, there's... So there's a little quality control issue with this one. I, but anyway, but I was going to say, though, the downside of the Joe's figures are I did get a Viper that was... I have a Viper that was very loose-legged. I mean very. And I wasn't happy. So I did request a return from Target. And luckily, they let me keep it. Just said they gave me a refund. So, but again, the leg's not great. Um, and again, then on this one, so yeah, this one's leg's not great. So now kind of like now I am tempted to try to get a return on this just because I don't know I'll check it out when I get done on here later but uh, anyway so regardless this figure is kind of cool for a Joe it fits the classified line itself with the other figures I believe um, the Snor Storm Snake Eyes probably does too realistically but that other the Baroness not really the other Kiki or Kiko or whatever her name is. Uh, probably not. Storm Shadow. Not really. This not the Storm Shadow. The one coming out soon is the one we've all been wanting. So. But anyway. So there you are. Uh, number 20. Uh, Scarlet from Snake Eyes. Pretty good looking figure like I said. But you know. I just got unlucky and got one has a bum leg so so to say yeah it just it's not just not tight on the I don't know why so anyway maybe may see about returning now I was gonna if I can get a replacement without having to pay then yeah so anyway there it is Scarlet number 20 GI Joe classified um, maybe do another video or two real quick got lots of new masters of the universe figures um, have found several of those at Target lately. Um, other than that, don't really have anything else new, new that I haven't uh, can video. Did my Zartan the other day. Just posted that today, actually. Um, did that on Christmas Eve, and that was actually something my parents had um, informed me of that I had ordered and showed up. So, anyway, there it is, Scarlet number twenty, classified. Guys, hit that like and subscribe button as always. Thanks for watching. I'm Beast from Beast Toys. We'll see you.